is up guys, it's your boy JR Vlogs here. In today's video, we're gonna be removing the spare tire and the spare tire hanger on a 2014 to 2018 Chevy Silverado, which is, I imagine it's the same for younger years because I did it on my buddy's 2005, so it's probably all the same, but we're gonna remove both of those, and I did it on my buddy's, it was pretty hard kinda because the, it was all rusted and we couldn't get the cable to come out, but we got it done because we cut it off, but shouldn't be as hard on this one because it's newer. So we're gonna remove that because I don't like looking at it under there and might do something under there like maybe a train horn or something like that. So we need that gone. So let's get right into it. Before we get into today's video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. See you there. All right guys, so the first thing we're gonna do, pull the truck out and back it in so we can work around the back because that's where we're working. So let's do that. So, number one, as you can tell, it's pretty big under there. I don't like seeing it from behind. And it has to be gone to get a train horn under there, or if I wanted to put a different exhaust on there. So, we'll get rid of it now. Probably give us another 2,000 horsepower, maybe, just to get rid of that weight loss. I think it weighs like 600 pounds, probably. But, <laughs> we'll get rid of that. So, first thing we're going to do is get something to lay on. And then, I, on my buddy's truck that we did it on, it didn't have a key that you had to take this part with. But on the newer ones, you have to have your truck key to take the lock out so nobody can steal your spare tire. So, we're going to take the key, put it in there, and pull it out, which I'll show you right now. Alright guys, so what you do is you just take your key, put it in the hole, and you twist it, and when, it, when you twist it, it holds the key in there, and it pulls out the thing with it. See, I got some sand in there and stuff, but it's sealed, waterproof sealed. And then back there, which you're not going to be able to see probably, this is a lighting. Let's see if we can zoom in. No, you're not able to see. But there's a square end in there, and in the back seat of the truck, you're gonna have tools that you're gonna stick in there, and then you're gonna twist it, and it'll drop the spare tire down. So we'll get the tools out, get something to lay on, and we'll start lowering it down. All right, so the tools we need are under the back seat right here, and all you gotta do is loosen this right here, and then that clamp will come off, and we'll take them out. So I'll meet you back there. All right, guys. So in the package, we got four different things. One of them is this tool, which I'm pretty sure goes for the jack. And then we got this for tires. And we have two of these shafts. One's already in there, and the big end goes inside there. And then the small end attaches to this big end, and the small end goes on here. And then we crank her this way. And as you can see, it's bringing the spare tire down. Alright, now once it's all the way down, there's a cable right here. And that thing on the end of it, you just twist like this sideways and put it through the middle of the wheel and pull it up and then it's out. So now, what we can do is go to the, this and twist it all the way back up so it'll pull that cable back. And now the cable's all the way back up in. We pull the tire out. And then I'll see up under there to get the bolts out. Alright guys, so if you're on the side of the road and your truck breaks down because you got a tire that's popped or blown up, then you just put that back up in there like we did and throw the tire on, throw the old tire in the back of the truck or something. But 
we're taking the spare tire out because we don't like it there. So now what we're gonna do is just pull this whole thing out. And as you can see, it does scratch it up a little bit. Then we're gonna take it apart, put it back in the case right there. And now we're gonna go up under the truck. All right, so the big one goes right where you got it from. And the big one like that. And then there's two smaller ones go in these two slots, in the middle slots. And then this one over here with the thing on it goes in like the side one over here. And that folds over like that. And the top one velcros. And now you can put it back. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. That's all we got for today. We got our spare tire out. And, uh, yeah, new things will be coming. Thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.